In this work, we introduce a novel method to support remote telemanipulation tasks in complex environments by providing operators with an enhanced view of the task environment. Suppose you are remotely controlling this robot arm in this kitchen environment, and this is the viewpoint provided to you by a camera in real time. In this case, the viewpoint happens to be sufficient for picking up this object, but what about if your view becomes occluded, such as by items in the environment, or by the robot itself? Or, what if you need a very particular view in order to successfully complete the task, such as viewing this toaster from above in order to place the bread? Lastly, what if you want to check if there's a mixing bowl you need on the counter just outside of your field of view? In our work, our central premise is that the camera should dynamically move in order to continuously adapt and improve the viewpoint to better support effective manipulations by the operator. Using this approach, the viewpoint is able to adapt to the geometry of the environment in order to see around occlusions caused by items in the workspace or by the robot itself. The viewpoint is able to adapt to the semantics of the task in order to provide a specific viewpoint given the task at hand and the operator is able to independently move the viewpoint in order to visually explore the environment, get their bearings, and plan future actions. In order to move the viewpoint on the fly, our method uses a two-robot system where a user controls a manipulation robot and a camera and hand robot alongside the manipulation robot continuously servos to provide a sufficient view of the remote environment. In this example, the second camera and hand robot continuously servos to adapt and improve the viewpoint to see into the drawer, and the user is able to reach into the drawer in the remote environment with the viewpoint provided on screen. The user is able to naturally control the translations and rotations of the manipulation robot's end effector using a motion controller in their dominant hand and is able to visually explore the environment or provide suggestions for how the camera should move with a motion controller in their offhand. Our method utilizes the RelaxIK solver to achieve real-time motion optimization performance. The solver utilizes a flexible, nonlinear optimization framework to handle motion synthesis problems that dynamically trade off between multiple objectives and is able to produce per update motions that accurately follow end effector pose goals without exhibiting collisions, kinematic singularities, or joint space discontinuities. We incorporate our geometric, semantic, and visual exploration viewpoint adaptation types into the RelaxIK optimization framework by adding additional terms in the objective function. We have demonstrated the effectiveness of our method using two evaluations, including a user study where even novice users were able to use our interface to remotely control a robot arm to complete tasks in visually complex environments. Such tasks included a sock sorting task, getting kitchen items off of shelves, and organizing pills in a pill tray. For details on our results, please see our paper or come talk to me at the poster session. Our method generalizes to any two robot arms, and we provide open source code to set this up. Thanks so much, and I'll answer any questions after this session or at the poster session.